Wembo, a little late on that tech chase, and Polish is looking to make him pay. Takes the stock. He's got a full stock lead here, sitting at only a 10%. Still has a lot of crouch cancel options here. Yeah, Falco's got a pretty strong couch cancel game against Fox. Fox has to be careful about throwing uh, back airs too oh, carelessly. Oh, the charge, and that's... All, right. All you had to do was roll, Polish, no! And look at Wenbo, he's coming back with a Fury. And by that, I mean right into a back air. <laughs> got some back air wars. I do love that. I, I love the oh. side view. Interesting. I think that's most likely a tech flub, but I kind of like it actually. He's escaping. He's escaping. It's all good. Great angle in, oh, no. then the wave. Well, playing against like a fox or a falco, you can expect to get at least like one or two stocks a set just off of a missed ledge dash. Practice your ledge dashes, people. That's it's at almost all levels, it seems. Like, yeah. Even at the top level, you'll see like ledge dashes are hard. You just got to practice them every day. Yeah, I'm. I have. I have problems with ledge dashes. I can do it perfectly if I fast fall down, and then it's like, why even ledge dash? Because you lose all your iframes. And that's why I don't play Switch. Wow. I, I just got to say, I, I'm loving Polish's edge guard game. We saw him drop one against uh, Wenbo last game, but he's been doing a really good job of using the lasers and forcing Wenbo to recover from some awkward spots where he's really vulnerable to just getting down aired. And even though he just SD'd from it, you see him going back to the platform hack stash. <laughs> Ooh, great string of up airs there. Putting him up at 87%. And just like that, Wembo has a lead. Oh, oh no. and just as I say that, the gangster laser. Is that gangster laser, or are we just gonna call that the leopard laser? Honestly, standing laser with Fox. He doesn't shoot it sideways, man. It's not the gangster laser. It's the left laser. Oh. Looks like he was going for the uh, wall jump. Wall there. jump. I think, yeah, he just missed an input there. Weird input to miss. I like that from uh, Polish. He tried to fade back with the down air, um, which is usually smart to keep him safe. Wembo was just one step ahead, able to kind of dash in and punish. And Wembo's going in right now. That's kind of his MO. Lands the back air. The, it turns around the edge guard. Wembo's up two stocks now after Yoshi's counterpick definitely paying dividends. I mean, Polish had <laughs> <laughs> forwards miss forward smash into miss forward smash into down smash. Hey, if it works, don't second guess it. <laughs> exactly. If it's if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Oh, Ooh, very stringing nice. Stringing together a bunch of aerials. presence of mind to get the jabber set there. I'm seeing a lot of down airs in the neutral from Polish. Down air is just like such a good tool for Falco in the matchup. I'm, obviously everyone knows how good it is at comboing, but it's also... Oh! Uh, okay. Well, um... So, um, game three, um... Yeah, what I was what I was gonna say before Polish kind of left us all speechless was uh, Downer is really good at like walling Fox out. You can kind of like do it in place or fade it back, and it's really hard for Fox to challenge. Um, and then it's also such a strong approach tool because it just brute beats crouch cancel. So uh, you know, Polish with the downers. I mean, he can do as many downers as he wants. He's got to be able to make it back on stage. So Polish with his counter pick going to. Pokemon yet again. He absolutely loves this stage. And it's done him well. Like, we saw the games against Jerry. We saw the games against Wembo really. Against Wembo. Misses the shorten there from Wembo. I think he was going for the mid shorten. Yeah, it's such a hard shorten to do. Polish just lasering in the corner, and uh, Wembo's smart enough to know that there's ways around lasers. I know it. Especially at low levels, it's really hard to deal with someone who just lasers a lot in place, but Wembo shows us all it is possible. That was, a that was a very good laser. It takes away so many options from Fox when he has to recover low. Definitely, uh, Polish it just leaves you so susceptible to just be side, just be down aired. And if you miss that, if you miss the small window that you have there, it's stock. I think that's been a big difference so far is that Polish has been able to really capitalize on those edge guards. Whereas uh, Wembo's struggling a little more to edge guard, and we're 
Only a minute in. Wembo's on his last stock. Yeah, he's just, he's falling for every single one of Polish's traps. He's just getting shined way too many times. And uh, that would have been really cool. Oh, and Polish with another ST. This is a, it's a good set, don't get me wrong, but there is definitely a little bit of slop on both ends. Polish was just, you know, saying, I respect that comment. And Polish is in a bad situation here. You don't want to be in the tree as Falco. He's got a slower jump squat. So even though they both have shine, it's a lot harder for Falco to land his shines consistently and pressure Fox. Just like this, I mean, we are talking, Polish was up after the first minute, and now at the second minute, Polish closes it out. Okay. There you go. Okay. Definitely, Wembo definitely bringing it back there. Always a scary situation when Falco comes down and it's even stocks just because, you know, the Shine Gimp's always a viable option. Just back to our Shine. This momentum is absolutely huge in this, and giving a Fox just a little inch can absolutely come to bite you in the ass. <laughs> um, so we, CFD has the counter pick here. Uh, Wenbo dropped a lot of stuff. I remember the first time they played out of his up throw. He, he dropped a couple jump cancel up smashes, so maybe he's taking that to heart. Looking pretty clean right now. I think he missed an up tilt there. I don't yeah. think he wanted jab. Wemo's looking, looking good. He doesn't want to let this advantage go. Um, as soon as Falco gets enough space in this matchup and is able to put up the lasers, uh, you know, it's kind of on Fox to find his way in. So every knockdown, every time he lands a hit, he's just going to want to keep chasing Falco without overextending too much. One ball looked like he was going for Ooh. Oh, goes for the suicide right. down air. I don't mind that from Polish at all. Uh, Wenbo had a lot of momentum that stock. So just kind of trade and reset, make it an even game. Falco's 0% combos on Fox are just... Or just in general, rather, are just so strong, too. Yeah, that's why everybody wants to play Falco, right? They all everybody want to do the pillar combos. Nice forward Great. smash. Forward smash actually catching the uh, angle to ledge there. And he's, Polish he's, has just been getting so much mileage out of his edge guards. He's gotten that that specific edge guard at least three times. You think that Wenbo would start, you know. Oh, good shine from Wenbo. You think that he would start going, like, above the ledge a little bit more? 